Hey everybody, it's Tyler with Gaia Force Gaming with a gameplay video for you guys from our locals at Cool Comics and Games in Cape Coral, Florida. Um, this is me on the right playing Black Hybrid, and it is Kyle on the left playing uh, the Zafraga deck, Liberators. Um, so this is, I don't know how much he's been practicing, this is my second game. With the Black Hybrid deck, I lost round one and I had that footage and I got corrupted, which I'm very upset about because it was a really good game uh, and I was able, I would have been able to showcase a lot of mistakes that I did make against uh, Ancient Gururumon and a lot of things that he did that really helps navigate around the Black Hybrid matchup. I thought it was very informative, but that is lost. So this is going to be me reading a bunch of green cards because I haven't looked into them. I go straight into this guy, give my mother blocker, which I did <laughs> say out loud, but I just didn't push it up. Um, like physically, I was like, I'm gonna raise mother, evolve here, give him blocker, and there he is. Anyway, I'm going to the mom and mom, get the uh, Shoto anyway, get the other guy blocker. It's all good. Again, more me reading cards. Um, full disclosure, I did ask Kyle after the game why he made so many questionable questionable vortex swings and he thought it was a mandatory effect. So this whole time he thought that vortex he had to swing. So there are a d couple key points where you're going to ask yourself, man, why is he swinging into this big blocker with vortex? He fully thought that uh, if you could swing, you had to with vortex, which uh, that would be a detrimental effect, if anything. But... Uh, that answers that, so hopefully now he'll be able to navigate the matchup a little bit better. Um, there, I'm just going to my mom. My mom's getting some free tamers. The Black Hybrid deck does use the Shoto Mother Engine and a bunch of uh, just tamer support to utilize the uh, Mind Link Black Tamers to get reusable, um, reusable, you know, hybrid fodder essentially, as well as just abuse like the Goad effects that make. Opponents attack to get free aces. I didn't love my build, but I threw it together literally minutes before the event. And this was, again, my second game with the uh, deck at all. So he's able to go into this big boy, but I do have Mother Blocker. Uh, so at the end of the turn, when he does unsuspend, it's going to be crazy if he swings. And again, we... Already went through the fact that he thought he had to. So he's swinging at me, swinging at Mamemon and redirecting to me. I'm going to blast. D to evolve there. And then block. Drawing a card off tie. And it goes to me. We'll raise up mother. I have a Vikemon now. I'm gonna swing, pop the boy. Taking a shot at 6k. We're gonna play Bokomon. Evolve to Grundle. Gain the memory back, take a swing. And just end the turn with another Satsuki, making one of the mother's blocker. Let's play a search tarot. And from there, I just take game one with some swings. We shuffle up and go into game two. Um, I, I should have, I wish I had asked after this game about why he swung with Vortex, but I wait until the end of the next game. I thought maybe he just thought if he redirected with, with his ability that I couldn't then again redirect with block. Uh, I don't know. I wish I would have asked here because it could have saved him some 
really uh, just plays that put him in a bad situation in this game coming up. Uh, but again, that's week one. You know, we're learning new rules, we're learning new sets, new decks. Um, I do open Mother Shoto, which felt good. He evolves in that back to the Mooch. Is that a Moochomon? Let's play his Shoto, which is the other version of Shoto. I get to drop Boko, grabbing a Sephiroth Mon. Let's play the Liberator promo to add card to hand. And play out the Searcher Tarot to add a couple more cards. From here I do go into the Satsuki, fall to the Sephiroth, gain the memory back with Boko, and force the attack. On Mind Link at the end of the turn, we're going to block just to get free removal essentially. Body on the board. Plays another Liberator promo. Playing out the Shoto himself. Evolving up. And giving him a blocker. I'm going to evolve into the Mame Mon. We're going to get the tie. And then I'm just going to drop another tie, giving one mother a uh, blocker. He's going to evolve up, suspending himself to play out the boys. Play Vortex Resonance. Search a card, let him evolve into Zafraga. Oh, just do another Gale. Then he will unsuspend and give Blocker. Gain some memory with my Shotos. We are going to go into the Vikemon to D to Evolve 2. I'm going to swing popping the other one. Does hit the security effect. Here I'll go into Sephiroth Mon, say that that guy has to attack next turn, do hit a Shoto. Swing with Boko just for some chip damage, hit a training boost. We're going to evolve into Rapid, which would de digivolve, um, and give one Mother Blocker. So there he has to attack, I'm going to blast into the Mega Gargo. Blocking there to trash the top security. Drawing a couple cards. Giving it all to Boko because I want to be bigger. Why not? I don't think he's going to be able to get over the 15k mother. Uh, but I could be punished by this. He could get pretty big and swing over with a vortex. And then I could just choose not to block. There he goes into the Sabraga. He will unsuspend, and then here's where he vortexes. <coughs> Excuse me. Even though he shouldn't.
So I'm just going to take that 15k block, and realistically, that could have cost him the game. We're going to swing trash the security, then swing for game. And then uh, then we talked a little bit about it, so hopefully he learned a little bit. Um, thank you guys for watching. It's week one. We're learning. Uh, these games will become more smooth and uh, more informative as the meta develops. Uh, for now, that's that. I'm playing Busted Black Hybrid uh, just to give it a little try before the good support comes out next set. I'm, I'm having fun with it. Uh, anyway, let me know what you guys think. I love you guys. Bye.